Hey guys, in this video, we are going to take a look at the MIUI 10 based on Android 9 Note Pi for a Redmi 5 Plus or the Redmi Note 5. So, without wasting more time, let's start. So, guys, this is not an official update, this is just a ported uh, MIUI 10 based on Pi from another device. So, you can see all of your info here. So, in all specs, you can see Redmi 5 Plus, which is the Redmi Note 5 Indian. And device name it says Mi Phone MIO is an MIO 10 by uh, Xiaomi.eu. So, this is a U like Xiaomi.eu ROM and it's based on 9.4.11 beta Android version 9 by Paintier Android. And Android security patch level is 5 April 2019. Also, mine is a 3G RAM variant, so it is sing and it has a Zook AirPods kernel. And yeah, that's it. You can check status, IME, and everything. As you can see on the home screen, like it's home screen in the app door itself, we don't have any Google apps, so this is also a deep bloated version. And also, the EO ROMs are of course deep bloated, so we get this one also deep bloated. Into settings, everything same. MIUI 10, it feels a bit laggy though, as it is not optimized for our device, it is ported from a device, so it may be laggy, but yeah, it's Android Pie with MIUI 9, like MIUI 10, sorry, not 9, obviously so yeah you don't like have to actually complain about it like it is uh already uh been given before the official me team so yeah like really good thanks for the dev for doing this for us the stock camera is me camera of course we get with miui and it has the ai mode i don't think it will work so you have to try it guys uh, square then panorama also we had this uh, short video which is like default me stuff uh, then into photo uh, we get some additional features from me so these are all normal stuff which we get like already so there is no extra uh, stuff in this but yeah everything works fine also if you find the camera force closing just reboot the device and that issue will be fixed and I faced it in first boot then afterwards it didn't so yeah it is working now clearly well and there are no other issues let's check into the settings as you can see we get like nothing new we just have this full screen display which was not present in oreo i guess yeah we have it here and we have to go back to previous skin like previous app uh, gesture also but i like this one the normal one so yeah, it looks really nice it works well not that much laggy but yeah it's our Snapdragon 625 device now mine is a 3GB RAM so it will like better obviously perform on the 4GB RAM variant so yeah you guys can like check that like as this is just a first uh, ported version of that one so maybe we'll get some more before the official MIUI release also guys one more thing I would like to show you is that it supports manual camera compatibility so it supports camera to API which means you can install gcam so that is also a great thing and yep like you can install gcam on this mio one like the mio versions of gcam which are already found and like you can easily run on them so yeah one more thing we get is the mio lab uh, i guess this is discontinued but yeah it's still there in this thing and we have this ai preloading so ai preloading increases app launch speed so you can just enable this and check if it like actually increases the speed and this is about artificial intelligence so it will like adapt if your like apps are like preloading slowly so it will just increase the speed that's it also guys as you can see on the status bar like android pi aosp the clock is set to left also we have VOLT present so there is no worries about geo sim card obviously for indians and other geo networks law like sorry other vlt networks which are supported by carriers for other countries also also guys as you can see with miu at 10 we get this new ui for the quick settings the notification icons the toggles and everything it looks really nice also the native blur uh, quite looks really really awesome but yeah it's a bit laggy so you have to be like dealt with it and we'll just wait for official miu 10 update how it is does it lag or not yeah we'll check everything after it comes up soon so guys that was just a quick go through over this rom so now let's just move towards the installation and let me tell you guys to install this miu 10 based on pi you will need to have unlocked bootloader and also tlrp recovery installed also as you can see in this uh, recovery menu uh, the android like advanced power menu 
we get a lot of options like recovery and fast boot like the extra options so you can easily press on this recovery mode and go to recovery and there is also the traditional way to boot into recovery which is to power off device and after it power off uh, press the volume up and sorry volume up and the power button now let's meet in the recovery mode okay guys so i'm using the twrp recovery which is the 3.3 version uh, unofficial by rama and now we will just like easily flash it so you can flash it on orange fox too but i'm using twrp so if it fails on orange fox or if it like has something else errors like sending out errors you can install this twrp and i will just link it down below in the description now this is just a rom and uh, there are no g apps to flash that are just the g apps which have save on internal storage so yeah just to flash this rom uh, nothing else just leave your device until it boots and then you can set up so we'll just wait for this to uh, install after it gets successfully flashed just reboot system if you want you can flash magisk i recommend the latest 19.1 stable and yep that's it uh, also guys if you have flashed any boot logos uh, i already made a video on boot logos present here in the i button so if you flash any boot logos it will just revert to the old one so you can flash it again and uh, yeah so this is the miui boot animation the loading screen you can see three dots and yep it will boot in like a minute and you can set it up and enjoy my your 10 based on pi so yeah if you guys like this video press the like button if not press the dislike button or subscribe down for more videos and i'll see you guys with my redmi note 5 or the redmi 5 plus very very soon so bye bye